Hey guys, welcome back to the Don't Scratch It Challenge. Uh, today we're going to be going, well, we're going to be going downhill. And uh, I'm going to be using, so we'll click on that, we'll click on that, we'll click on that. And um, we're going to use the Vanquish. Um, and we're going to be going down the hill this time. Now I won't be able to do the 177 uh, until I get uh, to level 33 so we're not going to even worry about it. So let's do this. Let's go down. Let's go down the hill. Oof! She be pretty. She be pretty. Beautiful cars. I love Aston Martins, man. It's so pretty. Let's go. So, we're going to try and uh, not wreck this one. Like we did the V12 Vantage S. Which was really disappointing, if I'm honest. You know, you, you think you got it. You think you, you... Okay. You know, you're like, oh, I can do this. Oh! Okay. So going downhill, uh, as a heads up, if you're using this car and you're going downhill, um, and you hit the brakes, the, uh, the tail gets alive. Like, I mean alive. Not just active. It, it, it wants to disconnect. So we'll slow down. Nice and slow. Roll on the throttle. And we'll slow down. Nice and slow. Won't go too fast. Ooh. That's really close to that wall. Um, another tip I can give, um, well, this and any racing game, um, when you're braking, try not to steer, um, especially in a car uh, like this, that's, that's heavier. Because um, as soon as you start steering, things go really weird. Like, the, the vehicle dynamics go really, really odd. And I know it's hard because your your first inclination is to, is to steer. But uh, you got to try and avoid that. Slow the car down as quickly as possible, like that. And then roll on your throttle. Because as it stands, with this car being front-engine rear-wheel drive, is it will want to slide the back around so just be mindful of that but again you know if you guys are watching this you already know that so I just want to sound important oh it sounds so good I don't know if it sounds oof Again, I'm not trying to get these points. I am concerned about not scratching and wrecking this car. Oh, I can't see. Slow down. It's just... Oh, I'm in full-on concentration mode. And slow. And just gently roll on your throttle. Oh, man. Again, like I said, I can go off the road, just can't scratch the car. 
<clears throat> and again, it's funny, as the further you get, I, I said this in a previous bit, uh, the further you go, you go, okay, well, I'm almost at the end, you know, and you start getting complacent, and then you're going to wreck your car. Like last time, I went full throttle through here in the uh, in the 4C, and I almost booed, um, and I, I smashed the car up, so that was pretty bad. All right, let's check out the replay. Let's check it out. Whew. My delayed start. <laughs> Look at the interior. Look at that pleated interior. It's just gorgeous. Like... Like, look at that. Like, that's just gorgeous. That's a gorgeous interior. I love it. I love it. it sounds very, very good. It drives very good, too. It, it drives exceptionally well. Believe it or not. Um... V12. I love the color, too. I love that blue. It's just beautiful. Oh, that, that growl. Did you hear that? That as it went around the corner. That's very nice. It would have been nice if they had the... Um, the four-door Aston. That would have been awesome. The, um... Oh, man. I can't even remember the name. I think it starts... What, what is that? I'm going to Google that. Because I can't remember the name of it. It is the Rapide. I'm a derp. Yeah, they should have had the repeat in this. That would have been awesome. If you've never seen it, you got to look at it. That's a beautiful car. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. Oh, that sounded nice that passed by. That was really nice. Wow. Did you notice that the taillights have the same kind of shape as the emblem, as the wings on the emblem? That's like the little white parts that you see in the light look like the the bottoms of the wings oh, for the Aston, Aston emblem. I don't know if that's uh, just me or if that was a design idea, but that's exactly what it looks like. Oh, I love that. I love that car. I love it so much. Oof. And again, it's not like I'm driving slowly. You know, I, I am driving pretty damn fast. But, uh... I'm obviously driving slower uh, than if I didn't care about scratching the car. Because it's so easy to uh, run wide 
uh, to miss your breaking point and and get a scratch. You know, not necessarily just just like slide off and wreck the car, but you know, just scratch your car. And that was one of the reasons why I came up with the challenge was I was like, well, I wonder if you could, how many I can actually, out of all of the vehicles, how many I can actually go through without scratching. <laughs> There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. The Aston Martin Vanquish. Such a pretty car. It's beautiful. Like, just, oh, so pretty. Oh, I love it. So, next up on the, uh, the list will be, I believe, the Audis. Yeah. So it'll be the Quattro will be the uh, the next one uh, in the lineup. Uh, so we will see how that goes. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really do appreciate it. Uh, you guys are great. You guys are the best. So as always, take care of yourselves and take care of each other. I'm gone.